Once you log into Seller Express for the very first time, you'll need to set up your account. This process is very simple and we walk you through it. The first step is to add your first channel. Seller Express has been designed as multi-channel software, so normally you'll have multiple channels to add in, but we always add our first or primary marketplace first. To add this marketplace, click Add Your First Channel. On the which channels I should add first to Seller Express screen, you're given advice on which channels to pick. If you have eBay as a channel, we would normally recommend using it. Once you've read the information, click the red X to close the screen down and choose your primary marketplace. On screen now you'll see free links, one for Amazon, eBay or Play.com. Depending on which primary marketplace you're selecting, click the right link to go straight to a video that will explain the next steps. Here we're going to set up our Amazon account. Although I've selected Amazon UK, the same process would apply to our other Amazon accounts as well. Start by clicking on option 1, Login to Amazon Marketplace Web Services. Once the Web Services screen is opened, click on Sign Up for MWS. At this point you'll be asked to log in. Log in with your standard Amazon login information. Once you've logged in, you'll need to select the second option down. I want to use an application to access my Amazon Seller account with MWS. You'll notice that we need an application name and application developer number. If you jump back to Seller Express, you'll see these details are saved on screen. Just copy and paste them in. When they're filled in, click Next. Accept the terms and conditions and hit Next again. We now have our merchant ID, which again we just copy and paste into Seller Express. When you're done, hit Link. Here we're going to go through linking your Seller Express account to your Play account. The first step is to enter your Play login details. Next we need to get your Merchant Store ID. This is easy to do. You simply go to play.com and find a product that you're selling on. Click on your name to open up your store. With it open, have a look at your URL. You'll notice it says a seller equals and then a number. That number is your merchant store ID. Simply copy, go back to Seller Express and paste it in. Once you've done this, click link to complete the process. Here we're going to go through setting up your account on eBay. I selected eBay UK, but the process is the same for any of the eBays. The first thing you need to enter is your internal account name. This account name is internal to Seller Express. It's to allow you to distinguish between different eBay stores if you have multiple of them linked to Seller Express. Your item location is just that. It is the location of your stock. This is normally the geographic location and down as your city or your county. Next we have our country and then your postcode. Finally, and finally you enter in your PayPal address. When you're done, hit link account. Simply log in to your eBay account and when prompted to, click I agree to grant access. Once you've finished, go back to Seller Express and hit finish. With your inventory added into Seller Express, it's time to import our products. Whether you imported an Amazon Play or eBay account, you'll come up with the same screen now. Simply click Auto Import Inventory to bring your products into Seller Express. The auto import process can take up to 45 minutes, but normally it'll be done before then. You have several options you can do in the meantime. We're just going to pop into Seller Express. Once you've logged into Seller Express for the first time, you'll be displayed a list of to-dos. These to-dos are our way of making setting up Seller Express as simple and easy as possible. Each section walks you through different parts of the software, explaining how it works and how you can make it work for you. If you don't want to do them now, that's no problem. You can come back at any point and the system will remember which to-dos you've done and which you haven't. Thanks for watching this video. Please find more information in this video's description and explore and find out more at www.sellerexpress.com.